What's going on everybody? Welcome back. Justin here as always guys. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out with me and Pete today to react to the brand new Clerks 3 trailer. Uh oh, I said his name. I said his name. <laughs> get Lay down Pete. Get in your bed. Uh, so I can't even tell you the amount of self-control and restraint it took to not watch this trailer today. I'm a massive Kevin Smith fan. Admittedly, I haven't cared too much for his last couple movies. Yoga Hosers was just okay. I found Reboot to be quite a disappointment, if I'm honest. I think the end of his truly great era was probably with Tusk, um, but I love all of his older films. I first saw Clerks back in, I don't know, probably 95 and I've just been a huge fan ever since. He's earned the right at this point to make whatever the hell movie he wants to. He's been in the game for so long. He can make his movies as self-referential as he wants to at this point. I feel like he's earned it, and I think that's what we're gonna see with Clerks 3. Um, I already know a, a basic plot breakdown for this trailer. I did a video on it a while back, but I expect the same meta references, the same self-referential jokes, the inside baseball meta nature of Kevin Smith comedies is kind of just what his films are built on these days, for better or worse. But uh, Clerks is something special. I absolutely loved Clerks 2, um, a little more than Clerks 1, actually. Um, and uh, I hope this is good. I'm almost scared to watch it. I just, I want to love this movie so bad. Uh, let's just watch the trailer and and hopefully it's not, hopefully it's not cringy. That's, that's all I can say. Here goes nothing. There's the boys. Doing the dance. Gonna play a little hockey on the roof, okay. We did it in the 90s, son. Damn right. You got damn right, son. Birthday. Really? Should I try mouths now? What is this? A <laughs> Tinder date? Get off of me. Uh, Elias chubbed up a little day. bit. I need the ambulance at the quick stop. Save my life, man. Wish I had a life worth saving. What are you talking about? Just sit around and watch the same movies over and over. I always thought you could have made a cool movie. You're right. I'm living on borrowed time. No more watching movies. I'm gonna make a movie! Still trying to make something of their lives and have a little bit of meaning. Working here, Meta. Everything in the script is something either Meta. me or someone I know said. I'm not even supposed to be here today. Maybe Jay and Silent Bob could be characters. Jay and Silent Bob are like C3PO and R2D2. They've been here since the first movie, which was the last time they were cool. But they've been with the franchise so long, they still give them cameos and put them on the lunch. I love seeing these two on screen. My phone's probably too loud. You put in that stuff you used to say about the Death Star contractors. Get sued by Disney. Oh, no boy. Now that's what I call acting! <laughs> Take off your pants. I'm, lo I'm loving all the cameos. Uh, what the hell is this? Hey, oh, shit. Where you get shot. I'm not letting you kill me off in the third Referencing act. the deleted ending, sequel. the original a ending. Sequel. What am I, a hack? Okay. I think it needs more weed. All right. That looks great. I don't know what you guys are thinking. I feel so relieved that I'm happy with that trailer. I really, really am. That is a lot to take in. We have characters from Clerks 2. We have characters from his other movie. We have Elias from the second one who uh, has been hitting the, hitting the, the, uh, Cow tippers a little, I love that. We all indulge a little bit. Pillow Pants is a little troll who lives in her pussy. All the main players are there, it's so good. It's always good to see Jay and Silent Bob. Everybody, of course, looks older. Everybody looks different, that's to be expected. I actually love the concept of this movie, I really do. Apparently, Kevin Smith had a whole nother script or a whole, at least an outline for a whole different story, but he completely changed it when he had his heart attack and then kind of references that with Dante's heart attack and him wanting to film a movie in the store, which is just meta on meta on meta on meta, which I love, I think that's a fantastic, fantastic story. And it really fits into the struggles that Dante and Randall have always bitched about over these years, trying to make something of their lives, trying to make uh, the best of the time that they have. And I think him jumping into gear, uh, after his heart attack to make this film. It looks like he's filming the, uh, the movie in black and white, seeing that little Jay and Silent Bob scene. I imagine the movie that they're gonna be making is just like everything we've already seen before, most likely. Uh, I, I can't wait. I can't wait to, to see this. 
I, I guess I'm, I'm wondering if the movie that they film will just end up being the first movie and when they show clips of the movie that they filmed, it'll just be the first Clerks. Um, them reshooting or shooting things that have already happened throughout the years at the quick stop. But uh, let me know what you guys think. I think it looks awesome. I'm very relieved that I didn't hate the trailer. I think it looks, I think it looks fantastic. I hope it's good. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of the Clerks 3 official trailer. I think it comes, uh, I think it's coming in September. So we'll get to take a look at it in September. Um, hopefully he'll tour it again. I was lucky enough to see him on tour a couple times, uh, bringing his movies to theater. So maybe we'll get a tour and we'll be able, we'll, we'll be able to see this with uh, a Q and A or something with the boys. So uh, awesome, guys! I think we're done here. Thank you so much for watching. Stay weird. Remember to always be yourself, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.